Hi, this is a, a quick experimental screencast. I'm just going to see if I can use Firebug, which is a Firefox plugin, to demonstrate live JavaScript examples such as I might do in a lecture. So, to do this, I'm just going to pop into my course on Web Applications Technology, which is one of the courses I teach at Swansea University. And I'm going to flip into a lecture that I've got to give on Mon on Tuesday next week and uh, it'll, it'll actually be actually in part two actually so I'll have to go back a bit just bear with me a second here uh, this is not very interesting this part of the screencast because I'm not really demonstrating this this is what I want to demonstrate so I want to open this lecture And basically what I've I've got here running is let me just press reload, it's asking me to reload, so I'll do an F5 just to reload the page. What I've got here is Firebug's console feature, which is something that uh, comes with Firebug is a, a web application developer's toolbox and one of the things it has is a is an interactive JavaScript executable. So if I come down this lecture a little bit to where I find that you've actually got a first JavaScript example, I can copy and paste that from the the notes into this window here and then I can also define another function which is farewell. I can pop that down there and then I can say OK describe and I can run that and there you can see the uh, this function actually runs as if it was in a in a JavaScript, and I can also say farewell. Okay, if I go back to the actual uh, presentation and back to where the example actually was. I can actually show you so show the real live script. If I can find the the code link. So here is a script. So I open that in a new window, a new tab. You can see that it actually behaves just as it did interactively. So I think this has got quite a lot of potential for actually doing uh, live JavaScript demonstrating JavaScript in lectures by actually playing with it on live rather than uh, just showing slides about it. And I think this might be quite interesting for the students as well. So I'm going to, I'm keen to try this on on uh, on Tuesday, and I'll I'll probably blog about how it went. Okay, that's all I wanted to say. Goodbye. This has been Chris Jobling, and this has been a Screener Slidecast. <laughs>